I've adapted two short books by the poet Christopher Reed. There's A Scattering and The Song of Lunch. One is autobiographical, one is fictional. Uh, one is serious and one is seriously funny. The main connection for me is relationships and uh, a very different relationship in A Scattering to the one in The, S the Song of Lunch. Christopher Reed's ability to put into words what he was feeling um, I think is a gift, a gift of expression a gift of articulating emotions, and um, I think they have their place in theatre. It'll look spectacular. Charles Peaty's uh, animations are glorious. We're so lucky to have Charles Peaty's animations for these pieces as well. I think particularly um, with, with the Song of Lunch, they just add an extra depth to the story. We're not literally having lunch. The poem and the animations beautifully bring that element to life for us. So we don't need to get um, overly bogged down with props, which is helpful. And I don't have to eat a whole bit of sea bass. <laughs> the way that Christopher writes, it is so clear, so immediate, so emotional, so funny, that audiences get it straight away. It's about love, I suppose. Whether it's uh, the loss of love to, because uh, a relationship has ended or whether, you know, in the first offering, um, the, relation, the, the partner has died. They're both about love and loss. And there's a lot of drinking in the second half. And so the show is called Love, Loss and Chianti. <laughs> <laughs>